Hi, it's a tour of the town. It's Russell Smith and I'm Phil Hello. Lamb. And it's a nice uh, sunny bank holiday Monday. We're in the town of Caister um, in North Lincolnshire. Yes. About 25 miles north of Lincoln. And this is a... Uh, <laughs> What's <laughs> a, a former... <laughs> A former Roman town, we can see some stretches of Roman Roman walls. Um, it's quite a small town and we hope to uh, stop off at a pub for a nice cosy drink as well. And it's got some nice Georgian buildings as well, Russell. Yeah, it looks good. And it's lovely it's to come also in. Uh, quite a few wasps around here as well, yeah, so we're going to get moving before we get eaten fruit, by the wasps. So blackberries are out on the... That's right. ...bloom and things. Uh, that's, uh, yep. um, food and, food. Uh, yeah, let's, let's get to this then, Russell. Looking forward to this Are one. you ready? I'm ready. Let's okay. go. <laughs> Town Hall. Us buildings around here, Russell. We've got a police uh, station just across there. 1855. Got some beautiful Georgian buildings around here. That. Look at that one. It's gorgeous, isn't it? We're going to go up Chapel Street towards the uh, church. It's a lovely little town, isn't it? What have we got here? What does that say? Can you read that? Something chapel? Wesleyan Chapel. Wesleyan Chapel. Yeah, it is, it's 19th century, isn't it? Yeah. A big grand building. Still a chapel, yeah, because I mean, you put it houses, Yeah, it looks like. Oh, welcome to uh, Caston Methodist Church. See it on the sign there? Yeah, yeah. Church Street, so we're going to go uh, right onto Church Street. A huge uh, little Thorpe House. Very grand. Come down here onto Leaving Chapel Street onto Church Street. It's lovely, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Right in front of us, we have the Church of uh, Saint Peter and Saint Paul. Paul. Yeah. Medieval church. That's beautiful, isn't it? Apparently this church is uh, by, uh, it's got uh, Norman origins, uh, 12th yeah. century origins, but it's got some later additions like most churches have. We're going to have a look, should we? Yeah. Hey, so it's a really nicely kept uh, churchyard. Yeah. Lovely, isn't it? We've got an uh, old carriage by the looks at there, Russell. Yeah, congregational church over there. Yep, yeah. just across from the churchyard. Yeah, and um, we'll be taking a look at the old Roman walls later on. Uh, I think we're going to have lots and lots to see here, Russell. Yeah, I think so, yeah. <laughs> Okay, are we going in, Russell? Yeah, I'm going to Okay. Now, we're going to talk about this store. Is this with the... Uh, this doorway has a lot of uh, 14th century arm work all over the place, look. See that? Just entering the church now, and we have mm. into the nave. Oh wow! So we've got uh, the nave, uh, north and south aisle, four bays. Clear story, Russell. Yeah. Russell just cleaning his hands. Yeah. Whenever he gets anywhere near me, he immediately wants to wash his hands. Mm. <laughs> Chancellor Arch, I know I sometimes get it wrong, Russell. Yes. <laughs> so, in the so the roof is uh, seems to be quite well decorated. Yeah. Font looks quite old. It's got a font uh, cover cover on there, isn't it? Well, what is old, Russell? Is the tower arch, which is Norman? Oh, yeah, see the zigzag yeah. decoration Zags, on there. Yeah. The 12th century. Strange looking like font, it sort of tapers, way. doesn't it? It's sort of like yeah. a, a bit of like an hourglass shape. Yes. Beautiful uh, 12th century Norman tower arch. Fantastic. West towards the Chancel Arch. It's still got the uh, the rude beam is still up there, Russell, with the uh, crucifix. Yes, it's. Uh, I'm not sure it's a survival from the Middle Ages. It's sign of the rude screen. Here is, is the medieval effigy. It's very early, isn't it? Incredible, yes. Yeah, so 13th century. 13th century, yep. Yeah. There it is. Camera, 
Just yeah. check this guy out. I mean, his face has sort of dissolved away, Russell. We have a, another stone effigy of a knight. Let's take a look at this. Look at the detail, look. The uh, effigy of Sir John de Hundle. High Sheriff of Lincolnshire, 1343. So we're talking mid 14th century, but look at the detail in there. The uh, chain mail. So we've found a third one down here. Yep, yeah, we have one on the floor here in the, in the North Transept. Uh, no details on who this is, so we've got to check up on this one for you. There we go. Uh, female this time. Looks as though it's from the same period, Russell. Yeah. Yeah, Markle Monument. Mm. The craftsmanship that must have gone into this to make it, yeah. you know, last so long as well. Absolutely well, superb. Is, is there a hundred and so years of... All that much, isn't it? About 50 years nearer than the other one. Yeah, it's 1343, is it? Yeah. So, uh, yeah, a good 70 years later. 70 years, yeah, so. Hey, we're still talking like the mid 14th century here, so <laughs> getting on towards uh, 700 years. Yeah. One last let's call me yeah. Looking west, on the nave. The uh, South Arcade here, Russell, on the just above the columns, we got some uh, carved heads. Um, so, oh my goodness, Russell, what have we found just over here? <laughs> oh wow, this has got, got to be the highlight to any church, is it, isn't it? Well, Mr. Teddy, what are you doing here then? A giant Winnie the Pooh teddy bear. Oh, my goodness, what's this? What's this? Wow, look at this, Russell. Tour of the town in Cakes to North Lincolnshire. And guess who's joined us today? Yes, it's, it's Mr. Teddy Bear. Fantastic. So, here in the corner of the church, we actually have a little tiny museum. Uh, and as Russell is showing us here, complete with audio guide. Yeah, enjoy this. Yeah. Thank you. So we finished here at uh, St Paul, St Peter and Caister, and it's a magnificent church. I think Excellent. the highlights, Russell. Are you, the oh, highlights I love the you? tombs, the medieval tombs. The yeah. tombs, of course. Yeah, yeah definitely. I think definitely the highlights for me were probably the large, big the fluffy door. teddy bears. Yeah. And uh, the win, the old yes, iron work. the Norman remains, the arm work, yeah. ball flower. So yeah. a, yes, the ball flower. There's an awful lot to see here. Yeah. But now we're going to leave the church. We're going to go into uh, do the tour of the town. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so here we are, Russell, at the old uh, Caister Roman War. Yeah. Uh, Romans occupied Caister in AD 69. Uh, fortified town between 100 and 300 AD. Uh, the wall was probably built in 8300. Mm. Four metre thick walls. And you can see part of it just here, Russell. There it is, all coming Yeah, yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> well, oh, yeah. not a bit. It's all partly in somebody's garden, really, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's all coming apart, really. Well, Roman wall, that is. No, it's a lovely garden, isn't it? Mm -hmm. There's birds' houses and everything, look. Hotel, yeah. Yep, insect hotels. Mm. That's gorgeous. Mm. Wow. Won lots of awards, this garden yeah. as well, look. Yeah. Yeah. It's Very impressive.
case there, Arts and Heritage Centre, might have a little cafe out there. Yeah. This is uh, this is lovely, isn't it, Russell? Yeah, place, Yeah, I know. Very nice town. Now we've got sections of the Roman wall over here to our right somewhere. Take a look. And here's one of the many springs you can find in Caister, which may have lured the Romans here in the first place, Russell. Uh, Cypher Spring. So this is uh, Plough Hill. This uh, pink building on the crossroad looks like an old hotel, doesn't it? Or something. More big Georgian buildings. Looks like a uh, oh, it's a Catholic church there. Look. Yeah. There we are back into the marketplace. Fish and chips, Russell mix, Caster uh, chippy, uh, Chinese takeaway. Oh, what else have we got? Post office. Yeah. These places closed today. It's Bank Holiday Monday. Pizza just behind you. A lovely sort of collection of old uh, 18th and 19th century sort of Georgian architecture around it. Oh hello there sir. Fancy a drink? Nice yeah, cosy well, drink? Yeah, I'd rather go on I think so. Let's go for it then. Yeah, yeah. Butter Market, yep, yeah. coming onto South Street. War Memorial to World War One, I, I suppose. The White Heart Country Pub and Rooms. She has accommodation. Yeah, cheers. Cheers. <laughs> the uh, White Heart Inn here in Caister, yep. and it's just gone midday, and it's beautiful at the moment, it's low 20s, rain's held off, and uh, what do you think of the town so far? Then, yeah, Russell? very nice, yeah, lovely. It is. Very uh, pretty, flowers out. It is. Um, mm. We've got a little bit more of the town tour to do. Mm. Um, at the moment, I think it's a re really splendid little town. Yeah. I'd spend more time here. Lovely. Our friend the wasp again, and the wasp is back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to sting you, it? It did. Has? Yeah. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Yeah. It's stung you, is it? Yeah, it's the sting. Quick. There's two of them. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, here we have South Street, we have some nice Georgian buildings on either side, Russell. Yeah. Uh, Russell and I nearly got stung by the wasps in the pub. I think we're over that madness now, yeah. Yeah, we've been attacked by a couple of them. The Loft Brick Tree Gallery. They're sort of artisan area, Russell. And this is Bob's Lane, yep. Which brings you back round to uh, South Street. Lovely little street, this. Oh, yeah. Mill Lane there. Look, look. Oh, yeah, it's like a little heads look up there. Is it? Very cute little cottages. Uh, the George Court. So we got, got it. wine merchants along there. Uh, this place here just look uh, side by side. Are oh, you right? Yeah, it does look like an old inn. The uh, the carriageway there, typical 18th century inn.
the George Court. Ted's Coffee and Gelato. And uh, Sweet Shop and the Little Gift House. Yeah. Okay, so we finished here at the uh, Roman town of Caister and uh, yeah, it's a lovely, lovely, lovely little place and I uh, definitely recommend visiting here if you're ever in the area. Uh, just as we leave in town, just popped into the co-op and we found some really interesting things, Russell. You'd like yeah. to show us this one first of yeah. all. Mocha. That's a like mocha like coffee that. chocolate coffee, beer. Yeah. How about that one? Uh, that's not all. No, another one. So show them that one. Yeah, dark fruits porter. Dark fruit porter. So how about that? So mm. we can enjoy ourselves with those later on. I've got a bottle of with me, so that's right in my so have I. room here. <laughs> nice and cozy, yeah? yeah. Nice and cozy. Fantastic stuff.